Hello everyone, it's Miss Serini. I wanted to make a quick tutorial video for you to show you how to easily access and navigate Edmentum. So the first thing we need to do is go to teachhub.schools.nyc. That is the Teach Hub platform that allows us a single sign-in to um, have access to a variety of learning programs and digital platforms. So this is the Teach Hub sign-in page. You guys have seen it before. It's pretty much for anything that we need for the New York City Department of Education. The first thing you're going to do is put in your username, just the name and number portion, this is mine, and then your password. Once you do that, you are able to switch over and it brings you to this. This is the primary Teach Hub page. Um, when you get logged into Teach Hub, you want to click K-12 to in the top, and it brings you to these different learning programs and platforms. There's a whole bunch. Um, you can also use this to access Zoom and a variety of other things. But today, our focus is getting to Edmentum. So you're going to click right here where it says Clever here and once you're in the very top section you're going to see the rainbow letter E that is Edmentum we're going to click Edmentum <clears throat> and it's bringing you through the login process and here you are so this is a student's Edmentum homepage and when you want to do your activities for your learning path you just go right down here you have start math start reading and you click them it'll bring you right into a lesson that is designed specifically for you remember the Edmentum learning path is based on your map testing so however you did on the map testing you will now get lessons to support and improve your skills in both reading and math everybody's learning paths are different and your learning path will adjust based on how you're doing so the more time you spend working on your learning paths and improving your skills, the more lessons you'll get to continue to grow as a reader and a math student. So the whole thing is very user friendly. I highly recommend bookmarking Teach Hub on your device, depending upon which device you use. If you're on a computer and you're using Google Chrome, you just tap the star in the right hand corner of the browser bar. If you are on a mobile device, there are a few different ways to bookmark. I will also send that information along to your teachers so you have it. But I hope you find this login video helpful, and I really hope you enjoy using Inventum. So far, the kids who are using it really like it, and I think it's going to be a great tool for PS96. Alrighty, guys. Have a wonderful day. Bye.